A UNLV student calling for better security on campus after he was pistol whipped and robbed. And this says we hear about a major change in how Nevada universities police their campuses. News 3's Antonio Castellan joins us live from UNLV with the story. Marie, regions with a system of higher education are consolidating their police departments. They're hoping to prevent robberies like the one that happened here uh, yesterday. The UNLV student who was robbed says he feared for his life. The person hit me in the side of the head with the pistol and knocked off my glasses. UNLV junior Matthew MacArthur speaks of the robbery he says he survived. MacArthur says he was pistol whipped Sunday morning near a campus parking garage off of Tropicana and Maryland Parkway. MacArthur says the thief took his food and wallet full of credit cards. The UNLV junior says he wants to feel safe on campus. We need to have better security, like we need to have more security cameras on the UNLV campus so that if things like this happen, we can find out who did these things. Leaders with the Nevada system of higher education have now agreed on consolidating the UNLV, College of Southern Nevada, Desert Research Institute, and Nevada State College Police Departments into one. The plan will save money and increase resources. That's everywhere from lighting, uh, more police uh, 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 personnel, um, equipment. UNLV Chancellor Tom Riley says the Higher Education Board of Regents is already looking for a police commander for this single force. They can utilize uh, one force uh, at any of our institutions. Um, we're also looking at, um, depending upon the situation and the events, is to be able to have forces move from one institution to another. UNLV students welcome such a move because they have many fears on campus. It's scary. It's scary to hear this type of stuff because this is basically where it's like, it's like my second house. So. Police are still looking for the suspect that attacked MacArthur. As for the regents with the system of higher education, they plan on having that United Police Force in action January 2020. Reporting live, Antonio Castellan, News 3.